Okay, so, <laughs> YouTube, sorry, but um, my camera decided to give out on me and stop working. So I'm going to start this all over using my iPhone. Um, so for Silver Witch's Brew, you need one large pot, stock or regular. You're going to need one gallon of apple cider. Uh, save the jug because if you're like me, yeah, you're making this ahead of time because it takes two hours um, simmering. You don't want to bring it to a boil uh, to make this, and we're going to stir it every 30 minutes. You need one orange. We're going to cut into um, three slices. I cut mine pretty big, um, and you also need an apple, which you also cut into three slices. Now, if you don't want to strain this like I'm going to, then you can cut your apples down and core them. Um, and your oranges, you can stick the orange peel in here to pull out later um, and just squeeze the juice of the orange in. That's always an option. Um, and you're also going to need three cinnamon sticks left whole. They're at the bottom. It's hard to see now because it kind of got darker. A fourth teaspoon vanilla extract. I use a different extract for each sabat. Um, this one I'm making for Ostara, so I'm using vanilla um, and nutmeg. Sorry. <laughs> um, and again, that is one fourth teaspoon nutmeg, and we're going to let this simmer. And sorry if I seem a little scattered. I can't believe my video camera gave out on me. Otherwise, you'd have seen it step by step. So I will show you what it looks like every 30 minutes through to the straining process. And yay, it smells really good. And it tastes wonderful. So I hope you guys get a chance to make it. 